We've been getting a lot of questions about using KV Core with Follow Boss, especially since Remax just added it to their tech stack. So I wanted to show you a couple of quick things to set up your um, KV Core site to work better with Follow Boss. I'm not going to go into great depth. We're not going to build crazy apps, uh, but just wanted to show a quick few tips on using your KV Core site with Follow Boss. So the first is just to install Pixel. It's quite simple to do this. The Follow Up Boss Pixel will help track activity across your contacts uh, once you have cookied them. And we'll cover that very, very briefly here in this video. But uh, what you want to do is go into your Follow Up Boss account. You obviously want to have your KV Core login. You'll be logged in over here. You want to come to your Follow Up Boss account. Um, admins or owners can do this. Generally, the owner account should probably do it. Um, but click on Admin, and you may have to click More to see integrations. And then you're going to want to click on Pixel by Follow a Boss. And so this is going to give you a, a brief description, a quick video on how to use it, what it does, um, a few more details down here. But basically, you want to go to tracking and just copy this code. You can hit copy code or, of course, just copy it yourself. Um, you may or may not want this enable form capture and creating new leads in Follow Boss. You can see down here if you already receive leads from your web website via API or email, maybe leave it off. Um, again, maybe something just to be cognizant of. Uh, it's going to depend on a lot of different settings and setup for you if you want that offer on. I'm going to cover briefly uh, email lead processing, which seems to work fine for KV Core as well. So we want to copy this code. Um, and then we're going to come into your KV Core backend. This is really simple. You're going to go to Web and IDX over here on the left hand side, Website Settings. And then just scroll down until you get to um, insert custom header. So you're just going to paste this code in here and hit save. It's that simple. Now, when you send out an email in Follow Boss or you send out something through Follow Boss that's going to be able to cookie the user, identify the user uh, as, you know, their email address or their phone number or name or whatnot, just get them connected, so to speak, to Follow Boss, you're going to see activity in Follow Boss. When they go back on your KV Core site, uh, you should have a smart list of recent activity. It's going to actually show you that, hey, old leads have been back on your site. You should follow up with them. So highly recommend installing Pixel. One other piece of this is that Pixel will install a short little widget on the bottom right-hand side with your Follow Boss phone number to help generate leads. If you go here to call to action, though, you can turn that off. Uh, you can modify it slightly. You can pick which number. Now, this number is across your pixel settings. So if you're installing this on multiple sites, um, you know, obviously be mindful of that. Again, you can turn it off. There's also a slightly different mobile versus desktop, and you can turn each off separately. So if you want to leave it on one, that's fine. Um, you can select one of your follow boss numbers um, or do this. What's cool is once people, you know, select one of your other follow boss numbers. What's really cool is if once people have been cookied, um, if you use the company number here, but the person's cookied and they're assigned to Bob on your team, they're actually going to see Bob's image and Bob's follow up boss phone number. But again, they have to be cookied for the system to know that this user is assigned to Bob and follow a boss. But a uh, pretty cool thing. Again, you can play with this after you've installed it. The code is not dependent on these settings. So after you've installed it, you can play around with these settings uh, and really get it how you want. But again, copy that code in KV Core, come to web and IDX, website settings, scroll down to custom header, install it, hit save, you're good to go. Now, one thing that I've been seeing, a lot of people are getting their leads coming in automatically to follow up boss. And some of that is through, I believe it's under API now, so admin API. There's a lead processing uh, that should most likely be on for your account. Uh, it's actually going to monitor your connected email to Follow Boss for anything that Follow Boss can determine is a lead format. Somebody sends you an email saying, hi, I'd like to work with you. That's not going to work. But any sort of form or email you get that says, you know, name equals this, email equals this, this person's looking, you know, for whatnot, um, is generally going to help come in. So you may check under admin API that this button is on. And as long as your KV Core leads are sending to this email, 
for the most part, it's going to create a new lead flow and pull those leads in. If you have multiple agents on KB Core on your team, if each one has their own site, uh, this can also still be done. Uh, generally, the lead flow is intuitive enough to figure out that if the if it comes from Bob's site, that we're going to assign that lead to Bob. So it'll do that automatically for the most part. You can certainly go in and round robin those leads if it's your site and you want to distribute them to the team. But lots of cool things you can do. So again, admin integrations pixel. Copy that code in under web and IDX custom header. You might do a test lead, maybe email yourself or somebody else on your team to get them cookied and kind of see it work. Essentially in follow-up boss, once you have that, you are going to now under recent activity see exactly what they're looking at, how many times they've looked at it, if they've saved properties, uh, lots of cool things. But you'll see that here in the activity tab. And again, having a smart list with a condition of recent activity, maybe even sorted by recent activity, could be a great way to follow up with even old leads who have come back on your site to check out a property or read a blog post or anything to that effect. So pretty simple, but really recommend Again, especially if you're getting this platform for free from Remax now, to just be sure you have Pixel in there um, and set it up accordingly.